Hey, what's up everyone? Shane here with ROA Off-Road. I'm super excited to share a full tour of the all new Paws by Palomino. We're actually gonna get over to the manufacturer and Dylan's gonna give us this walkthrough, but I just wanted to give you a quick little update on Paws and where things are at. Lots of people are pretty excited about this new brand. It, the fact that it's all made in America is really, really cool. Off-road, off-grid, they're doing some really, really unique things with their electronics that nobody else in the industry is doing. We are expecting to see these units land in December, so they're going to be here very, very soon. They're actually, we're going to be the very first dealer to get the very first units off the line, and they're actually going to our East Coast Experience Center out in South Carolina. Uh, reach out to us at 801 860 0035 if you have any questions and you want to set up a time to actually come and see them. We are also getting some units for testing and doing some videos and stuff like that. So we are going to go out and put them through some extreme torture tests out on the west just to go through the mountains and the deserts to really give a give them a good test. So stay tuned. We're going to have some really really cool footage coming out on all of the pause lineup. Right now there's two models. There's going to be four next year. But I'm really excited, just wanted to give you a quick update, but let's head over to the factory and meet up with Dylan and get a walk around. Hey everybody, Dylan Risser here, and today we're gonna to be talking about the PAWS Hiatus XC 20.2. And we're gonna start at the front of the coach here. And as we look behind me here, standard on all the pauses, we have a large A-frame storage box here. We have jerry cans on the side to show you what you can do with your setup here. If we open it up, standard we have two 30 pound LP tanks. Larger than the usual 20 pounds, we want to make sure you have enough LP to last you while you go off the beaten path, right? As we look down here, this is a articulating hitch developed just for the paws. So this goes side to side and eventually we want it to go up and down as well. So what you have here is when you're going over the rocks or over trees or anything like that, it'll sway side to side here. That way it doesn't impede the travel of your vehicle you're towing with. All right guys, we'll go to the front here. You notice we have a nice polyurea coating. This is another word or another form of saying rhino lining. This is something that a lot of people put in the bed of their trucks. It helps with abrasions, nicks, anything like that, and also covers up all the seams as well, so you don't have any water seeping through. We'll keep moving around to the side here. We have our Truma cooler. This is a dual zone cooler here. Comes standard on all the pauses. If we look inside, you notice that half of it is different than the other half, so you could either put refrigerator on one side, freezer on the other, or you put refrigerator on both sides, or freezers on, freezer on both sides. You have options. As we look in here a little bit as well, you notice we have our air compressor, an onboard air compressor there. So this is for our air suspension raises and lowers our suspension and also is used for filling up any tires that you guys bring along, whether it be bike tires or truck tires or anything like that. So it's super nice to have that as well. We'll go around to the side here. You guys are probably really noticing our graphics. We put a full body wrap on all our pause units and give you a nice design too. Windows, all the windows are dual paned. And when we go inside, I can show you guys how we can use the screen and shade system on these windows. Dual pane windows are super nice to have when you are camping when it's a little colder outside or, or it's hot outside because it really blocks those UV rays, helps from fading and gives you a better art value as well. As we look over here, we have our more ride aluminum triple steps that will actually fold up into the coach. They're super sturdy, have adjustable legs as well, so that way, you know, if you're on some uneven ground, you can adjust those legs and away you go. We keep moving around to the side here. We automatically see the suspension and the large tires and everything we got going on underneath. So I want to spend some time and talk about that because it's super important. So we have industry leading ground clearance. We can get you about 25 inches of ground clearance. The suspension will actually allow you to raise 12 inches and even lower all the way down to the tires. So when you guys are camping and if you want to cook outside on your griddle, well, 
It's low enough to where you can do so with ease and you don't have to be on your tippy toes, right? So we also have our aluminum frame as well. This is a huck riveted frame. It is all aluminum structural rivets, no welds whatsoever. You probably notice up front, it is a drop frame as well. This allows you to have more storage in the front. As we keep going to the back here, you notice our deluxe outside kitchen. Now, the thought process behind this floor plan was you're gonna do all your cooking, your cleaning, your hanging out outside, right? You're overlanding, you're in the great outdoors, you're gonna be outside. So what we give you here is we give you a stovetop, griddle, combination, three burner. We give you a large pantry as well. Two storage shelves here for plenty of room, so bring all your food and belongings from home. We give you a large Furion microwave, a spice rack, so make sure you bring all those spices along. And we give you a large refrigerator as well. Refrigerator freezer, might I add. Another cool thing about this is that it is hot in cold water. We have some outlets back there as well. And when you want to spray some things off, what you do is just pop this off here and you can put a spray hose in this port. You can spray your, you know, your dishes or you, know, you can spray your boots off, things like that. All right, so now we're on the back of the paws. You notice right away, we give you two spare tires, full-size spare tires. They are on a swinging tire rack, all right? So to operate this, just simply lift up on that latch. It will pull out and it will snap right into place. On this side over here, we give you a little drop-down table as well. So if you're working back here, you can put your tools on there, drinks, food, whatever it may be. And then what I really enjoy because everybody loves some storage, right? So we look in here, we give you about 63 cubic foot of storage. And for all you fishermen out there, we can give you some fishing rod holders up there as well. To operate this right here, it's a telescoping rail. You just simply pull it out. It drops down. You can easily walk up the stairs with some support on the side as well. As we look up, we do put lights on all four sides. We have a light bar up there and also some security cameras on all four sides as well. You notice that up top as well. All right guys, we're on the other side of the pause here and we'll start right back here. This is our Nautilus panel here in the back, give you nice access to it. What you see here, this is our ladder, our super heavy duty robust ladder to the top of the pause where you'll notice all our solar panels up there, seven 100 watt solar panels. And we look up, we see the light again and another security camera. So keep moving forward here. We notice our Fugati water heater is a tankless water heater. Continuous hot water. Another window, another dual pane window on the side here. Solar, portable solar outlets right there. So along with the solar on top, you can also add some more on the side. This comes to you at a option as well. We'll give you some suitcase solar panels here. That's what you have right here. And you can just plug them right in and get some more solar. Now as we look in here, you can use this as storage. And this is also where we put our inverters. We put our solar amp chargers in here as well, our 60 amp chargers. And then our battery is inside. You don't see that out here, but the battery is inside underneath the bed. So now that we've seen the outside, I want to take you on the inside and show you around a little bit. All right, so now that we are on the inside, as we look towards the front here, we have a, our large 60 by 80 queen bed. We have our t-shirt closets on each side. I'll show you that here. We can fit some t-shirts in there. You can hang them up on the rod that we give you guys. Some reading lights on each side. Outlets, of course, on each side. Super beneficial. And when you're laying down on the bed, we give you a couple skylights right above you as well. So when you're laying there at night, you can easily look up, see the stars. Just something that's super, super unique and super cool. With those windows, like I was mentioning earlier, we give you that interior shade system. 
to black out the sun, and then a screen that comes down as well. So when your windows are open, you can easily pull down that screen. Nothing gets in, right? As we keep moving around, we give you a large sink as well. So this is, so we don't give you a sink in the bathroom. We'll give you a large sink out here. We'll give you a refrigerator underneath as well. So that way you guys don't have to go outside to the outside refrigerator to get any drinks that you guys bring along. Something that you probably noticed already is our cabinets, they're not wood, they're aluminum. So there's absolutely zero wood on these floor plans whatsoever. So what we have here is your entertainment wall. We've got lights on both sides, give you a nice touch there. We have a fireplace below, actually give you some good heat in here, especially being that's a little more compact inside. Then we give you a TV as well. Something really cool about this entertainment wall is it actually opens up. We'll give you some lockable storage in here. So you can bring all your belongings, all your valuables, you can put them in here. If you guys are off walking on some trails, you don't have to worry about it because it's locked away. That's a huge storage compartment. Yeah, what are you trying to say? We'll go to the bathroom here, all the way to the back. We have a large fiberglass shower. We give you a skylight above, so all you tall guys can fit in here with ease. And then, again, when you're overlanding, you're gonna be going over some bumps, right? So we don't want any glass on here. So we give you a nice shower curtain as well. Some areas to hold your towels, got some hooks in here. Give you a porcelain toilet, a sliding door that is actually aluminum. So again, goes back to the whole no wood, right? So this is a aluminum door. Give you some storage over here for toiletries, towels, whatever you guys bring along. And then through here, a lot more storage in the fishing rod holders I was talking about earlier. So something I really wanted to mention to you guys is that these walls, the ceiling and the floor is actually all the same material. It's a transcore composite. So you can literally take a sledgehammer to these walls, beat on these walls and you're not gonna break through. It's actually thermally bonded together, foam on the inside, two pieces of fiberglass on the outside sandwiched together. You don't have anything glued on, so it's never gonna delaminate over time. And being that it is one piece, you're not gonna have any seams or no seam tape. And what we have here, this printing right here is actually a 3D print on the wall. So this won't peel off over time either. And notice, no seams whatsoever. All right guys, so now that we've seen the Pause Hiatus XC20.2, Hope you enjoy this video. Thank you so much, Dylan, for that walk around and that tour. I know a lot of people have been wanting to see more details and more tours. I know he didn't go into a lot of detail, but you know, you got to kind of see the trailer all the way around it really nicely. Uh, if you have more questions, once again, just reach out to us at 801-860-0035 and we can answer some of the questions on the, the specs and the details. You know, we've now met these guys a few months ago and we've been going back and forth with them. And we've been talking and collaborating a lot about some of the specs and some of the features that we wanna see. And they've been really listening to us. We're really excited about this relationship. You know, I got a text from Maynard who is, he's actually the one that really is, uh, he's created. This has been his brainchild. He's the one that uh, has dreamed up the pause and wanting to bring to market one of the best off-road trailers in the world made here in America. You know, and he actually texted me the other day and said, hey Shane, I've been watching your Conquer series down in Moab where you guys are going crazy. He's like, I love it. He's like, I wanna come out there. We need to set up a time to take all the pauses to, through Moab and do that Jeep trail. And I was like, wow, that's pretty crazy. And he's like, oh, the only difference is we won't have to turn around because the pauses will make it all the way through the trail. And I laughed, we're joking back and forth. And I just thought to myself, this is really cool. I'm really excited. We don't have a manufacturer that really wants to take their trailers out on these crazy trails. It's because it's kind of scary. You don't want them to break. But I was like, this is a testament to these guys. They have actually tested it at the military track where they test Humvees. And so they're pretty confident that they're gonna be able to take these trailers down into Moab and do these extreme trails. I don't know, I just thought to myself, man, this is really cool. I love how this relationship is evolving. 
and and I just wanted to you know give a shout out to the guys over at Paws and say thank you so much. We're really really excited about working with you, and this trailer I think is going to be a really really neat trailer. Stay tuned. We're going to have some incredible testing videos coming up where we're going to take them out and really really try to put them to the test. Hey, thank you so much once again. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and have a wonderful day. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.